בגמרא זה המעביר על מידותיו מעבירים לו כל פשעיו. Someone has a lot of crimes in his record. A lot of violations, sins, all kinds of problems. The Gemara say, you want to have a get out of jail for free card? You want it? You know, like in the Monopoly, you have a card. If you're stuck in jail, you give the card and you get out. So you want it? You want to get out of jail free? There is a great key to achieve it. What? It's ma'avir al midotav. You kill your ego, you control your anger, you're fuming but you don't say a word, people abuse you, you don't say, you don't retaliate, you don't have revenge. Could be your wife, could be your children, could be your brothers, could be your parents, could be your partner in a business. The neighbor, your former boss, someone you lended money to, and ma'avir al midotav. It's okay, Hashem. I don't want him to be punished before me. If he really doesn't have the money, I wish him to have the money. People ask you about him. How is this, this guy? Great guy. He doesn't know your money, no, everything is fine. You sure? Yeah, yeah, everything is fine. You sure he's a good guy? Yeah, he's a good guy. Don't you see? He's religious, he learns Torah. Oh, okay, good to know. We thought he's a monster, this, but you say it's okay. All right, good. He really is not fair to you, this guy. You could have buried him now. With proofs. It's called Ma'avir al Midotav. I have the right to be angry, I am not. I have the right to take revenge, I'm not. I have the right to warn people from him to ruin his reputation that he, that no, he would not dare to do it to someone else. I let go. It's in the end of Hashem. Whatever he wants to do with this individual, it's his business. It's a very high level. Most people cannot be quiet. Sometimes it's harder to be quiet than to do something a lot greater. Just not to talk, it's sometimes very difficult to 